today I'm going to teach you how to create an account in Scratch. First is we need to type Scratch dot meet dot edo. Click enter. Okay, so now we are here. So first we need to click this one for educators because we are teachers. If you are a parent, then you can click the parent button. Okay, so here, scratch for educators. Okay, now, as we can see here, the teacher account in Scratch, we have to click request account. Then fill out this information, create your username. In my case, I'm going to uh, use user1 and password okay next step i want username taken try another one okay user 11 and let's proceed next step already taken user Next step, Bert. Okay, let's see. Entry. Um, what means? What means? Next step, first name. User. Next. Step. Next step, phone number we have. Okay, click yes. Next step, organization, that rule, teacher, have a type of organization you can choose whichever you you want or whichever is applicable for you well said it's not required click next address we have okay next this is only optional so you can skip this one city state we have Okay, zip code is then next step how do you plan to use scratch at your organization integration Okay, you can type whichever you can type here your answer then click next email address okay then confirm okay send me updates and using scratch click next okay so confirm your email if you haven't already please click the link in the information email sent to so we need to open our gmail here to check our inbox so as you can see we received the email 
And now we're going to confirm the email address. Click this. And there you go. This is our Scratch account. You can change your profile. Okay. Click. Change. And choose your picture. I'm going to click open and there you go we can create our okay so now we can start editing and create our own scratch um, output so I'm I'm going to teach you how to use Scratch in a different tutorial. So for now, this is all for today. So I hope you learned something on how you on how to create an account on Scratch. So thank you and see you on my next tutorial. Goodbye.